Celebrities in the basement, the place to be. Karen Wilder Martin on your TV. Politics, drama, music, sports, arts. Favorite celebs, climbing the charts. First hand info on the live. Careers, next projects on the rise. Come visit Karen every week. Never know who's in the hot seat. Celebrities in the basement is the place. This is in the basement. In the city of brotherly love, the murder rate is on the rise. Highest in the God forsaken country. Just need more bread, that's all. Are you threatening me? Reunited with his son, a father. He finds himself at the crossroads. The need to make money, it must be satisfied. Caught up in the violent drug war. I'm just tired of these fucking pennies, man. Fuck I'm tired of fucking talking to him. You know this is gonna mess things up for us, right? Difficult choices have to be made. You said you wouldn't leave again. You promised. I know I promised. She stared at herself intensely. She knew she had to make a decision. It would impact everyone, especially your son. You give our love. Yeah, I got it. We about to go. I'll right, we'll handle some shit real quick. Witness. 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 I am here with the writer, producer, director, Diva Gordon. Witness. 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 Finally. Finally. You look beautiful thank tonight. You, First you, of all, you. congratulations on the premiere of Witness. Thank Tell you. my audience. First of all, what was the inspiration behind this film? The inspiration behind this film is that something is going on right now. Yes. Presently in the city of Philadelphia, so many of our young men and even some of our young ladies are getting involved in crime so young. Um, a lot of them have backstories that people are not familiar with, they're not aware of. And I figured that I would tell the story and give some of the background so that people understand sometimes these young men that are out here come from troubled environments, backgrounds, and if they're not taught something new, um, they're not gonna learn anything new. So it's more or less for people to reach out and try to help some of these young men make mm -hmm. better decisions opposed to just labeling them and judging them. Yes, yes. So a long time coming, you started filming, the, well first it was the stage play. Yes. So once you did the stage play, what was it in your psyche that said, I wanna do a film? Well, what happened was they recorded the stage production. Mm -hmm. And it was filmed. Yes. And it was filmed in a way that it was filmed. It was almost like it was a movie. So okay, I said yes. to myself, you know what? I'm going to make this a movie because yes. I wanted to give more of the meat and potatoes and I just didn't think that the stage was where I should just leave it. So. Yes, yes. And so give me some thoughts on your ups and your downs. Like what is one thing that you're extremely proud of and then one thing that you're like, oh, I should have did it this way or... Yeah. One thing I'm extremely proud of mm -hmm. um, is being able to use my platform for good. Mm -hmm. And I'm proud of that because it's a blessing to be able to write, but it's even more of a blessing to be able to reach. Mm -hmm. you know? yes. um, one of the things I wish I could do differently, I would say I wish I would have started this sooner. And as far as as far as, far as writing, film directing, okay, yes, my yes. film career. I mm -hmm. wish I had started it sooner because I know it's my passion mm -hmm. and it's something that I love to do. But it's never too late. True. Never this too is true. Late. Look at look where we are right now today. Yes. Okay. So, kudos yes. to you. Thank you so much. I'm excited about tonight. What do you want your audience to get out of this film tonight? Um, I want them to have a little more compassion for our youth mm -hmm. and try to work on some kind of way of reaching our youth because we're losing them rapidly, yes. especially in the city of Philadelphia. Mm -hmm. So I want them to take away reach, yes. you know, reach out to them. Yes, God bless. All right. Have fun seeing your work on the big screen tonight. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Congratulations. Thank right. you so God much. Bless. Bless. <laughs> God, let's talk about we are here finally to see Witness. Yeah. Looking it's forward. been a long time coming, hasn't it? Yeah. Tell my audience what character you play. Well, I'm a, a 
police detective mm -hmm. um, with uh, Nakia Dillard, mm -hmm. uh, who's on um, Wonder Years now, mm -hmm. which is pretty amazing. Mm -hmm. And uh, so, yeah, so we're, uh, um, you know, undercover and trying to, you know, fight crime. Yes, I love it. I love it. Bob, tell my audience, you've been busy yourself going traveling back and forth to New York. Tell my audience what you've been up to. Um, a lot of uh, standing in work for East New York mm -hmm. um, uh, on the set of that mm -hmm. uh, show that's coming out and then uh, Succession. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, and hopefully some principal work in the future, you know. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. What are we going to take away from this film tonight? That um, you have to think about what you're learning mm -hmm. as you're learning, as you're growing up and mm -hmm. take the positives as much as the negatives and more, you know, and uh, essentially that, take that away and look for lots of different role models, okay. you know. Wonderful, wonderful. Well, have a great time tonight. Yeah. Enjoy yeah. yourself. Yeah. Seeing yourself on the big screen tonight. Yeah, good seeing you. All right, you. God Thanks. bless. Take care. <laughs> now I am here with young Skylar Martin. Tell my audience what character you play. Young Tyler. He's so busy. He's playing Tyler and Trey and all these other characters in other films. I think you've done about what? Um, about five or six films now? Yeah, I think six. Wow. And tell my audience how old you are? I'm 12 years old. 12 years old and six films under his belt. Check his IMDB out. It's getting busy. So, young Tyler, tell my audience, give us a little bit of um, what your character is all about without okay. giving us too much. Hey, young Tyler, I'm a younger version of Tyler, mm -hmm. older Tyler. Mm -hmm. uh, I had to move in with my father mm -hmm. because my uh, mother, yes. yeah, she had to go away, mm -hmm. and I witnessed a lot of things in my father's house and it was bad. Oh, you witnessed a lot of things that you shouldn't have witnessed at the age you were, right? Yeah. So how do you feel about seeing yourself on the big screen tonight? You excited? I feel excited, yeah, yes. very excited. It you feels look dapper, I must say, you're looking sharp. Thank you. You look <laughs> sharp too. Thank you, thank you. Well, have a great time tonight at seeing yourself on the big screen once again. Yes. Never know who's in the hot seat of the